guys! Welcome to another episode of Learn Math with Sir Mark and on this video, I'm going to discuss applications of parabola. But before anything else, please don't forget to subscribe on my channel and click the bell button so that you will be notified whenever I'm going to upload a new video. So if you're ready, let's begin. Okay, so let's have problem number one. A parabolic dish or parabolic reflector is a curved surface with a cross-sectional shape of a parabola used to direct light or sound waves. Any sound waves entering a parabolic dish parallel to the axis of symmetry and hitting the inner surface of the dish are reflected back to the focus. A satellite dish is in the shape of a paraboloid or a 3D shaped parabola is, four, is 10 feet across and 4 feet deep at its vertex. How far is the receiver from the vertex if it's placed at the focus? Okay, so round your answer uh, to two decimal places. Okay, so suppose this is the parabolic mirror. Okay, so this is the uh, the light or the sound waves. Once it uh, hit the surface, the parabolic surface, it will redirect it to the focus. Yun yung sinabi, alright? Kung light yan or sound wave yan, after it hits the inner surface of the parabola, it will reflect back to the focus. Okay, imagine this is the parabolic mirror. And sub sa problem, it is 10 feet across, 4 feet deep at its vertex. So, okay, kunyari, ito yung partition plane. So, therefore, I'm going to place the vertex at the origin. Okay, for convenience, syempre, sa origin yung vertex. Okay, now, ang sabi sa problem, 10 feet across. So, okay. So, ito yung mirror, 10 feet yan. Okay, then 4 feet. Okay, from the vertex. Okay, so therefore, this is, okay, 4. There you go. So, now, meaning to say, okay, meaning to say, so this point here, alright, hindi kita, so I'll use green. Okay, so this point here, Okay, has a coordinates of 5, 4. Do you agree? Okay, so this has a coordinate of 5, 4. Okay. Kasi this is the axis of symmetry. Now, parabola opens upward, vertex at the origin. So, therefore, we know ang equation natin dyan. So, since upward, x squared equals 4cy. Okay? Yung H and K natin are 0 since the vertex located at the origin. Now, question is, okay, balikan natin question. Uh, how far is the receiver from the vertex if it's, if it's placed in the focus? So, ang hinahanap natin, gano'n to kalayo. Alright? Gano'n to kalayo. So, from the focus to the vertex. Okay? So, in other words, we're just looking for C. So, pretty simple. All we have to do is to plug in 5, 4 in place of x and y respectively. That is, okay, 5 squared equals 4c times 4. So, clearly, ang c natin is 25 over 16. Or, approximately, ang 25 over 16 is uh, 1.56. Alright, so 1.56. You need to measure uh, fit. Okay, 1.56 fit. See that? There you go. So this is our answer. Okay, problem number two. The cable of a suspended deck bridge are in the shape of a parabola. The pillars supporting the cable are 600 feet apart and rise 90 feet above the road. The lowest height of the cable, which is 10 feet above the road, is reached halfway between the pillars. What is the height of the cable from the road at a point 150 feet horizontally from the center of the bridge? Okay, so this is the illustration. So, once again, and sabe. So, the pillars is 600 feet apart. Okay, this is the road. Okay, or the bridge. This is 90 feet. Okay, yung height ng pillar. Alright, then there's the lowest point. Okay, is 10 feet above the road. Now, ang question is, how high? Okay, if 
150 from the center of the bridge. Kung 150 yan, ganun daw to kataas. Okay, so meaning to say, so if we're going to have a sketch ng parabola, okay, so definitely up, the parabola opens upward. Okay. Nangyari, yan yung parabola natin. Okay, so meaning to say, yung vertex natin is located at Okay, the vertex natin is located at uh, 0, 10. Okay? But this time, the vertex natin is 0, 10. Okay, so suppose this is the origin, yung portion na to. Now, like what we did in problem number 1, since 600, across, 600 feet across to, so therefore, yung point na to, okay, yung point na yan, okay, yung point na yan, has a coordinates of 300 Okay? Has a coordinates of 390. Clear? Okay. Once again, bakit 300? Because this is 600. Okay? So, since gitna yan, 390. So, ang question is, we are looking for the value of... Nata, kunyari ito. Okay. So, the question is, we are looking for the value of y. Okay. If x is 150. Okay? So, 150 y. Y. So, we're looking for the value of y if x is 150. So, now, how are we going to do that? So, now, so since the parabola opens upward, okay, so we're going to use this, okay, x minus h to be squared is equal to 4c y minus k. Again, positive 4 yan, positive 4c yan because the parabola opens upward. Now, vertex is 0, 10. So, what I'm going to have here is x squared equals 4c times y minus 10. Okay. Next, I have a point 390. If I'm going to substitute 390 to x and y respectively, makukuha ko yung c. Right? So, let's take one at a time. Okay. 390, substitute ko kay x and y respectively. So, that is 300 squared equals 4c times 90 minus y. Oh, 90 minus 10, I think. I, say, I mean. So, that will be, okay. So, yung c ko ngayon will be, okay, 300 times 300, okay, over 4 times 80. Okay? So, ilan yon. So, yung 300 times 300 over 4 times 80 is uh, cancel 1,125 over 4. So, this is the value of C. Meaning to say, yung equation ng parabola natin will be, okay, yung equation ng parabola will become x squared equals 4 times 1125 over 4. Tama? Times y minus 10. So, clearly, okay, clearly, makakancel yung 4 dyan. Okay, so what will be left here is x squared equals 1125, okay, 1125 times y minus 10. So, this is the equation of the parabola. But the question is, what is y when x is 150? So, meaning to say, substitute ko lang, 150 squared, okay, equals 1125, okay, y minus 10. And from there, makukuha na natin. So, y is equal to 150 squared, so that's 150 times 150, okay. So, that's, so that's uh, 225, okay, 15 times 15, so 225. Dalawang zero over 1125 and then plus 10. So, that will be the y. So, take note. Okay. Ang 1125 times 2. Okay. 1125 times 2 is 2250. Okay. So, therefore, this is just 20 plus 10. Okay. See that? Once again. Okay. So, cancel to. Okay. So, that will become 2. Okay, 
So therefore, the final answer here is y equals 30. Okay? So since ang question, uh, in terms of feet, so the answer is 30 feet. See that? There you go. So I hope you learned something on these two problems. Uh, Okay, on the application of the parabola. So, once again, feel free to share and of course, subscribe on my channel. Keep safe.